yeah, uh, for this year, for this year's oblation, we tried to present it in a different way. I mean, we've been going on, uh, with, going on with the problem of press freedom for a long time already. I mean, it's 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 an age-old problem. I mean, it's we experienced it in martial law with censorship. Years before, there was also censorship in some of the administrations prior to Marcos. And then afterwards, we're still experiencing it now. So how do you repackage something that has been, you know, uh, told over and over again? I mean, para sa mga ibang Pilipino, sasabihin nila, gas-gas na plaka na lang yan. Pero problema siya na kailangan natin konfrontahin. So ngayon taon, yung gagawin namin is ibang paraan. Kung baga, makita nyo mamaya sa paggawa ng mga placards, pag-express pa namin, usually kasi yung oblation non open. Uh, sinasabi mo talaga lahat. Ngayon, ang balak namin gawin is nakafocus siya sa katahimikan. Bakit? Yung press mismo, hindi na nakakapagsalita. Dahil sinusupil na sila mismo ng administrasyon. So, yun, yun yung nagiging problema. So, ngayon, yun sa amin, we try to present it in a different way sa masks, pati sa mismong pag-protest namin. Because originally, the oblation on was a protest art, a protest uh, a form of protest against Marcos administration. And it's necessary for us to go back to that, that form that it's a protest. And it has evolved to be a tradition of UP, but we have to go back to it because the, uh, the signs of the times call for it.